Democratic National Convention may be underway, but that isn't stopping Donald Trump from trying to steal the spotlight. Thanks for joining us. I'm Emily Gasulo. The Republican presidential nominee is sending one of his sons to North Mississippi to help campaign for him. There's no better place in the Magnolia State to do just that than at the Neshoba County Fair. WCBI's Tom Ebel was there for Trump Jr.'s big speech and has the details. I asked you all who you're voting for, but it seems pretty apparent. Uh... Donald Trump Jr. spent the day today speaking in front of an enormous crowd at the Neshoba County Fair. The oldest Trump mingled with state leaders and supporters, as well as campaigning for his Republican presidential candidate, Dad, Donald Trump. For those of you who don't know, it's not just about the next four or eight years. It's about the Supreme Court. Trump Jr. also spoke about the email scandal that has rocked the DNC. When you read those emails, imagine the Republican has sent those emails. Imagine Rice Davis has sent those emails. They've been pulling out the electric chair for him. For them, it's okay. It's a double standard. Residents and supporters appreciate the Trump campaign for taking the time to visit small town Philadelphia, Mississippi. I was thinking about it today. It's going to be hard to get an actual presidential candidate here to the fair, especially Trump with the crowds that he brings. So to be able to have his family to come, that's, that's a big thing for the fair. This isn't really probably the biggest money you could make coming here and spending your day here, but getting to know Mississippians and find out what we're all about. I mean, I'd love to be a fly on the wall of the plane when he gets back, but it's the hottest place on earth, and it is definitely a, a political opinion at every turn, and I think it's great that he took the time out for us. When I was a kid, Ronald Reagan came here, so it's always good when somebody like that, a national figure, comes through and recognizes this is a good enough place for them to drop by. Just to be here is amazing. The tradition, what's going on here for 125 years plus, I mean, it's just awesome to be a part of that. It's awesome to have this kind of welcome. You guys are the best, and I, I don't even need to tell you what to do with whatever you already know. You're doing it. <laughs> Reporting from the Neshoba County Fair, Tom Evel, WCBI News. Donald Trump's campaign schedule says the Republican nominee's next stop will be in South Florida.